Namaste. Namaste and welcome to Mindfulness Moment. This is a moment, this is a time in our day that we carve out to take pause, to come right here now. And happy Thanksgiving to you. Um, we're getting ready to celebrate this wonderful, wonderful holiday of gratitude. And it's so just incredibly, I am so incredibly grateful to be able to have the privilege and the time and the space to do this practice. So it's just a great honor to share with you. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's begin. Find a seat that is comfortable. You can sit down on the ground. You can sit in a chair, sit where you feel steady, where you feel steady, where you feel comfortable in this moment. So grounding yourself down and start to gently move. You can circle yourself around, deep breathing. In through your nose, and right back out through your nose. Just feel what it is that you feel in this moment, right here and now in your body. Head and neck are relaxed and this moment, right? Just opening up, you can change directions. Feeling this energy that flows through the body, relax the head and neck and shoulders. Come back to center now, and as you inhale, lift the arms. Go really slow. Let the breath guide the movement. As you exhale, float the arms back down. Again, slow, steady movement, guided by your breath. Inhale, rise up. Full, steady, big stretch there. You can lift yourself right out of your torso, right out of the hips. Exhale, dropping, 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 dropping down. Good, turn your palms up, lift, 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 release, tall and strong. Turn and twist to the left side. You're nice and tall here in your spine. Take your right hand back behind you and start the twist way down low. Feel it right there beneath the belly button, turning and twisting, feel your shoulders softening, deep and full breaths in and out. Good, as you inhale, bring the arms right back up. Lift, lift, lift. Again, a lift, belly is strong. Turn and twist. The breath is guiding the movement. Stay here and develop the twist with your breath. You feel it way down low. Comes into the middle of the back, to the shoulders. Feel this moment, this breath. Inhale, come back up to center. Bring your hands together. Bring your hands together as you exhale. Very present, the fingers, the prayer goes right through the midline over your nose, your mouth landing here at your heart. And what are you thankful for? This healthy body. This time, this effort. Take a deep breath in and let go. Release your hands. Good. A little shrug of your shoulders. We'll transition now. We'll start to do some cat and cow flow. And today I'm going to do that standing. Um, you can be on the ground if you want to be on your hands and knees. I'm not working with the yoga mat today, but you can always put uh, maybe just a blanket or something underneath your knees. Or if you're working on carpet, that's a good thing to do. Or you can come here and work standing. Feet are very clearly aligned. So looking down, I have an alignment with my knees and my hips right between the second and third toe. Hands come on top of the thighs and then start to undulate the spine. You round, 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 chin and chest drop. As you inhale, you go forward, chest is lifted, chin is lifted, belly sinks. So feeling your way here, inhaling, exhaling. Undulating the spine, getting movement and warmth to fill the body. Deep, deep breathing, inhaling and exhaling. Go ahead now, melt into a forward bend. Let your arms just drop down. If you're on the ground, you might just push back into a child's pose. Let yourself be wherever you are, resting. In this standing, resting position, my knees are rather bent. The top of the chest is just melting over the front of the thighs. Let go. The head and neck are soft and relaxed. And deep breathing. Deep, deep breathing. In the forward bend, we're going to walk the hands over to the left side. Keep the knees soft. Do the same on the ground. You can crawl your hands way over. 
pull the hip in the opposite direction as you reach your arms over to the left. Nice full breaths. Good, wherever you are, walk your hands to center. Look forward for a moment. Your chest is open. Exhale, surrender back down into the forward bend and walk the hands over to the right side, pulling the hips to the left. Stretching, expanding, deep, deep breathing. Good, walk your hands back to center and go slow. We're on the ground. We're gonna come up very slowly rolling the spine, coming up into a nice, tall, open space. If you're on the ground, you might reach your arms forward and come through a downward facing dog to walk the hands back to meet the feet. And eventually we'll all meet here, standing tall in Tadasana. Palms are facing forward, deep breathing. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Turn your palms forward, turn your palms forward, grab hold of your right wrist and way up and over to the left side. So the whole side body expanding and opening. Good, come back to the center. Left arm, pull and stretch and open up. Feel the breath moving through your body, stretching, expanding. Good, come back up to this center, separate your arms and dive forward, long spine on the way down into the forward bend, let go, let go. Inhale, come up halfway. Remember, breath guides you. Exhale, go back down. Use your body, use your breath, the whole body, arms reach to the side, coming up, palms touch at the top. Exhale, hands to heart, namaste. Inhale, rise up. Maybe each time you lift, you expand, right? Just take it in, take it in. Gratitude is such a wonderful vitamin for our bodies, for our hearts and minds. Come up halfway. Exhale, release, release, let go. Press down into the ground and rise up again. Reaching, 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 palms touch. Who were you grateful for? Exhale, hands to heart. One more time, inhale, rise up. Deep breath, exhale, down you go, feel the flow. This is a moving meditation, right? Breath guiding the movement, inhale, halfway up, big stretch. Exhale, releasing right back down. Press into the ground and rise up, rise up. Deep breath, palms meet again, exhale, hands to heart. Deep breaths. Planned pause, right? We're taking this moment just to reflect, to tune into sensation, to arrive in this moment. Bring your hands to your hips. Take a big step forward with your right foot. Big step forward with your right foot and stay on the ball of your back foot. And then you can play. You can push back, lift up the ball of the right foot, come back up onto the ball of the left foot. So kind of a push and pull action there, a push and pull action. Using uh, the awareness, using your core, your strength, start to bend that front leg, just the front leg. Keep the back leg nice and strong and straight. So front knee begins to bend. Arms drop alongside you. Lead with your heart here. Chair, sternum is lifted. Chest is nice and spacious. You draw your shoulder blades together. Lift your arms out to the side. Palms are facing up. And then gently keep rotating the palms, right? The pinky finger side is moving towards the sky. As you reach your arms, go ahead and bend deeply into that front leg. Nice full breath in and out. Take a deep breath and straighten your front leg. Hook your thumbs right up over your head and gently reach and expand. Pull your chest forward. As you exhale, start to hinge forward at the waist. Keep your arms in line with your ears if you can as you're dropping down here. Reach, 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 pulling, 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 exhaling slowly. You can just drop your hands one on top of the other. Slide your hands down your front chin. For some of us, the hands might meet the ground. Be where you are this moment. See if you can try to straighten that front leg. Push down through the outer edge of your back foot. Nice full breath. In and out. Look forward. Take the left hand to the outer right shin. Left hand to the outer right shin. Right leg is straight. Right arm goes up to the sky. So turn and twist and open yourself up. 
feel that energy going right through the tail, through the crown. You feel your body, you feel the breath. Look down, exhale, gently release that right hand back down. Use your breath, look forward, right hand to right hip, left hand to left hip, coming up slow. Use your breath all the way up. Go into the ball of the back foot, step that left foot forward. You're standing tall into Dasana. Deep breaths. And tune in, check into sensation here. Right, we plan the pause to come to the present moment. So this is all practice, this is all practice. Deep and clear breathing. Put your hands on your hips. Left foot stays forward, right foot goes back. Stay on the ball of your back foot for a moment. Kind of push and pull here, push forward and pull back. And push, you can lift up onto the ball of the front foot. And drop back down, lift up onto the ball of the back foot. Drop that back foot down, a little, a little slight angling of the back foot, the front foot. Start to bend the knee, palms alongside your chest is open here. Palms are facing the sky as you come up. Just pause halfway. Reach your arms as wide as they can go. Whole body here. Use your breath. Sweep your arms to the sky. Arm bones are down. Chest is lifted. Deep, full breath. In and out. Go ahead and straighten the front leg. Straighten the front leg. Reach your arms out in front of you hook the opposite thumb so which one did you do last time switch it up reach your arms forward try to keep your arms in line with your ears as you start to hinge forward keep pulling the arms pushing the hips back long full breaths your hands are going to drop slowly you can just drop them right them onto your front shin or maybe the hands drop to the ground your nose is to that front knee and the breath is flowing the inhalation the exhalation. That's based in the body. Keep offering that space. You can let your head drop down. Your torso can elongate here, opening up. Take the right hand to the outer left shin this time. Left arm goes to the side. Pause there for a moment. Bring that arm bone back in. And then keep revolving and lifting and expanding. Deep breathing here. Twisting and opening. Nice full breath. Good, as you exhale, look down, that left arm softening down to meet the right. Right hand to right hip, left hand to left hip, halfway, the whole body, and then slowly and gently all the way up. Good, take your time, you'll step that back foot in and standing again in Tadasana, feet underneath your hips, palms forward, chest is open. One sun breath here, inhale, lean back, open up the whole body. Exhale, flow forward, down you go. Inhaling, coming up halfway. Exhale, surrender, surrender, let go. This time really take time. We're gonna roll up slowly, bent knees, coming up, chin is gonna be last to arrive. So each one of your vertebrae as you come up, as you come up slow, unwinding here. Nice. Palms forward. Tadasana. So this one posture is a, is a wonderful way to, to check in, to just arrive. See if, if you are celebrating this holiday, if you're celebrating Thanksgiving, can you arrive in this space with a strong center and an open heart and deep, steady breath? See what happens. Everything can shift and change here. Hands onto your hips. Let's go into a little balancing. You want to hang on to something you can. Lift up onto the ball of the right foot and just rest the right heel against the left shin. So just get stable here, strong and grounded. Your gaze is forward. Take in the whole room. You can start to lift that leg up. The foot is now on the calf muscle below the knee. If you want to go a little higher, you can take it above the knee. I'm going to reach down and hike that foot up. So coming into a tree position, the sole of the foot pressing against the inner thigh, your hands to your heart, gratitude here, deep, full breaths. 
Nice and full. Float the arms up to the sky. Reach, expand, lead with your heart here. Lead with your heart. Maybe your gaze can even go up to the sky. If you've fallen out of the pose, simply come back in. Simply come back into the pose. Go ahead and look forward. Feel stability right through your center. Arms out to the side. Well, twist. Take your left hand to your right knee. And start to turn your gaze over towards the right, towards that right arm. And maybe you can even peek back behind. Again, if you've fallen out, whole body, come right back in. Good. Look forward. Bring that right arm forward. Arms lift. Dismount slowly. That knee can move forward, that right knee. You can kick it forward. And then as you exhale, step the right foot down to meet the left. Float the arms alongside the body. Pause here. Try not to fidget. Lift up onto the ball of the left foot. The heel rests against the inner shin of that right foot. So you go slow here. You can climb up a little higher. A little higher, not on the knee. It's below or above the knee. Press the foot into the thigh. The thigh into the foot. Arms float to the sides. Eventually the arms are lifted. The heart is lifted and stable through your core, through your center. Look up, pulling your heart to the sky. Deep, centered, expansive breath here. Good. Take your time. Your arms are going to come down to the side. Again, if you've fallen out, just come back in. We'll twist to the left this time, turning and twisting. The gaze goes slow. The right hand to the left knee, the left arm right behind you. Feel the energy. Feel the breath. You're in your center. Good. Go slow. You're going to unwind. Arms come back to center. Arms up. Bring that left knee forward for a moment. Kick the leg forward and then gently drop the sole of the foot down to the ground. Exhale, arms alongside. We meet in Tadasana. Inhaling. Exhaling. Inhale, sweep the arms to the sky. Exhale, flow forward. Long, beautiful breath. Inhaling, coming up halfway. And let's make our way down to the ground. You might climb out into a downward facing dog in that transition. Feel the stretch. And coming to your knees and then gently coming to a seat. Now you can sit in a chair if that's your preferred seat. Down on the ground. <clears throat> feet and in a chair. Feet are aligned with your hips. Fingertips, we're going to bring them back behind you, right? So you can turn the palms towards your body if that's accessible. If it's too much on your wrist, turn your palms back, right? Your fingertips back so that the heel of the hand is facing the hips. We're going to do a breath practice here. Feet are down. This is the breath of joy. This is a great gratitude breath, actually. Inhale, lift the chin and the chest. Deep breath. Exhale through your mouth. Keep the lift of your chin. Or keep the lift of your chest as your chin drops. And do this again. Inhale up. Exhale empty. Through the mouth, just letting go, letting go. One more time. Inhaling up, up, up. Exhale through your mouth. And now seal your lips this time. Keep that sound of HHA as you inhale. So you're going to listen to it. Lift the pelvis this time. Keep the mouth closed and HHA. Just like you're exhaling through the mouth. Do this again. Inhale up. Listen to the sound. Exhale, dropping down. Good. One more time. Inhaling. Pelvis lifts, chest lifts, heart is open. Exhale, down, down, down you go. Good. Extend your legs forward. The heels are still pressing. I'm not going to straighten my legs fully just to keep the pelvis nice and neutral. So it's not moving backward there. It's not pushing forward, but I'm very clearly on the tops of the sits bones. Float your arms up, up, up to the sky. Deep breath and then a hinge forward. So it's not a rounding. Keep the arms lifted. That will help you to accomplish that. Reach, reach, reach. Grab the outer edges of your feet. Look forward or your ankles, wherever you're meeting here. In your chair, you might be up a little higher. Look forward and then gently into the forward bend. If you're down on the ground and you can start to straighten the feet a bit, right? Start to straighten your legs. Feel the tension. 
tension. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, there's a little tension in the back of the legs, in the lower back, the arms. See if you can breathe into it, soften where you need to soften, and then go in a little deeper. Let the breath guide you. In and out. Go back to that breath practice. Listen to it, right? Listen to it. Listen to the sound. In through your nose. Right back out through your nose. Oh, expansive breath, let go. Take your time, you're gonna slowly and gently rise up, rise up, shrug your shoulders, and drop your chin to your chest and take some rolls of the head and neck. So these postures, we, we come to these beautiful shapes and forms for the purpose of the seat, right? To be able to sit comfortably. So what does that look like for you? Go ahead and prepare your seat. I have a blanket um, tucked underneath my cushion just to help me to lift the pelvis a little bit. I'm putting my cushion on top and then the hips will gently soften down here on top of the cushion. So the seat is prepared very mindfully, very carefully. I'm taking a seat called Sadasana today. So the right foot, I'm gonna kind of bring it in. My, my hips accomplish this, right? Accommodate this, listen to your body, right? The shin is down on the ground and then tucking that left foot right in front of that, I'm even pushing myself forward so that I, I root down through just the, the outer knees. You can feel that and you can feel where the pelvis is situated. It's nice and neutral here. I'm coming forward to uh, really accomplish that, a, a very comfortable, safe, grounded seat. And then go ahead and lift yourself up. Now, once you've arrived in whatever seat you've taken, take a moment to scan because we're gonna be here. We're gonna be here now. This again is practice to, to come into a physical stillness that the body is in a state, right? We've done a little movement that we really can begin to soften, that we can slow ourselves down, that we can commit to the center. We can commit to the stillness. Turn your palms up to the sky and let's take the dominant hand. For me, it's my left hand. I'm gonna slide it into the palm of the opposite hand and just gently touch your thumbs and begin to arrive here. Use the tool of your breath. And so you settle into the body, a steady, comfortable seat and come into right, a seat of meditation. And this practice on this day happens to be the day before Thanksgiving. So let's use that, use that beautiful opportunity to give thanks, to focus our awareness, to focus our attention, perhaps on all that you are grateful for. You can just stay here and just let, let things be just as they are, just taking it in. And perhaps instead of making kind of a, a mental list of all the things that you're grateful for, start to just experience gratitude in this moment. Gratitude for your healthy body, for your upright spine, for your aliveness in this moment. Stay with the experience. If the mind tries to distract you, maybe you're making or 
preparations for your meal or your travels, whatever that happens to be. Just pause and come back to this. Come back to this experience of body and breath. Try to stay in the stillness. Again, if the body tries to distract you, pay attention, just notice. Try to stay still, just a few more moments here. Go back to the breath. Become aware, become aware of your breath right at the base of your nostrils. With intention, with energy, start to deepen that breath, filling the body completely, emptying completely. Put your eyes open, sweep your arms to the sky and bring your palms together in a prayer, gratitude, being grateful for this beautiful, healthy body, being grateful for the opportunity to share this practice, being grateful. Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. We do this practice for the benefit of all beings. So hold that gratitude right there in the palm of your hand. Take another breath in. As you inhale, float the arms up, separate your hands and send it out into the world. May all beings, may all beings be free. May all beings be safe. May all beings be healthy. Bring your hands back together and exhale. Hands to heart. Namaste. Thank you so much. It is with great gratitude. And I have the privilege and honor of guiding you through this practice this day. Thank you so much for your attention and your willingness to just show up, show up and 
keep doing it. So thank you so much and have a beautiful, I wish you and your family a beautiful, beautiful, peace-filled holiday. Namaste.